Hello, welcome to Maths with J. So we're going to get the calculator to round a number to the nearest whole number. Now the way we're going to do this is we're going to fix the number of decimal places because if you want something to the nearest whole number you don't want any decimal places at all so you want zero decimal places. So let's have a look at how to fix the number of decimal places on the calculator. We'll shift mode and then to fix the number of decimal places we want six and we don't want any decimal places so that's zero and you'll notice that the display now shows zero with a decimal point after it. So let's now key in a number um, 23.5 And now when we press equals, you can see that when you would normally get 24, when you round 23.5, you actually get 24 followed by a decimal point. So when you write the answer down, you do not want to write the decimal point after the number. So let's try another number. So 59.2 equals 59 and so on. So any number you want to round to the nearest whole number, you just fix the number of decimal places to zero and then input the number and do equals. Or of course you could key in a calculation and at the end of the calculation the number will be rounded to the nearest whole number. So for example, 2.5 So 2.7 plus 3.1, that will be 5.8, and the calculator will automatically round that to 6, to the nearest whole number. If you've got your calculator set to math mode, when you do these sorts of calculations, they will come out as a top-heavy fraction. So what you would want to do is use the SD key, and that will give you the answer that you want.